Hello, I'm Nathan Judo. I'm here with Walsall reporter Mr. Joe Massey. Joe, you've got some news on a mystery man, a Saddler's mystery man. Yeah, Walsall's mystery <clears> man, <throat> yet to be seen really. Christian Bilek, uh, really unfortunate for him. He has picked up another hamstring injury and now looks highly unlikely he'll ever make his Saddler's debut following his loan from Arsenal. What a year, what, what a season, what a nine months this lad has had. It has been horrific for him really. He picked up a shoulder injury while at Arsenal at mm -hmm. the start of the campaign, couldn't train. He then injured his knee, a really serious knee injury. It was at that point he was getting towards t full fitness. Arsenal offered him out on loan. Walsall took him. Mm -hmm. He was sort of un they re they thought he'd be sort of two weeks away. Quality addition, really. He shone in the championship for Birmingham last season. Mm -hmm. So to get him in, in league yeah, one a was a, coup, yeah. a huge coup for the club. He immediately injured his hamstring, um, for just sort of in, in his recovery really from mm -hmm. that from that knee injury, just as, as players do when mm -hmm. they start to ramp up their preparations and training. His hamstring had a little tweak. Then this week, we've actually had comments from him, we've heard from him talking about how much he's looking forward to playing a major part for the Saddlers in these final eight games of the season. Yeah. And then lo and behold, the very next day, he's redone his hamstring. Um, really is awful for the lad. Um, he's only 20 years old, a player with huge potential. It's awful for Walsall because he is a talent and he would mm. give them real sort of... Uh, well, he gave, he gave him options because he would complain a few positions at the back and in central midfield as well. But it's, a, it's hamstring again, he's gone back to Arsenal. We think he's probably around three weeks away. We're not 100% sure on that yet, but there's not long left. Three weeks, it's unlikely he's ever gonna play for Walsall, I think. Goodness me. Uh, bad news on the injury front. Hopefully some better news on expressandstyle.com where you can find all the latest Walsall news.